Good day everyone! Since everything is going back into normal, we are here to demonstrate our lesson in mathematics and my name is Janelle Napila, my part is the lesson proper. My name is Vanessa Minson Marquez, my part is preliminary activities. And I am Jelly Rea Ardukuzin and my part is application until assignment. Good morning children, please stand for our prayer and repeat after me. I fold my hands, I bow my head, I close my eyes and pray. Dear Lord, thank you for this day and bless us. Amen. Once again, good morning children. You may now take your seat and I will check your attendance and say present if you are here. Understand? Very good. Janelle Napila, present. Jelly Dukusin, present. Very good, you are all present. So now, I have three important roles to discuss. First one is, respect me as your teacher and respect one another. Second, listen carefully. Lastly, raise your right hand if you want to answer. Understand? Very good. Who among you here can still remember our lesson yesterday? Yes, Janelle. Very good, Janelle. It's all about subtraction. What is subtraction? Again, very good. Subtraction is an art arithmetic operation that represents the oper operation of removing objects from a collection. Yes, very good. So now, let's read our objectives. At the end of the lesson, the pupils will be able to identify the addends and the sum of addition. Show cooperation through group activity and add the following objects and numbers. So now, I have a video representation and please watch and listen carefully. Understand? Very good. Hello kids, it's time to play. Listen to me when I say Hip 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 hooray We can do our sums today Teddy, one plus one Equals two One, two Pirate, two plus two Equals four One, two, three, four We'll do more another day So very good. So now let's count one by one how many leaves did, did you paste on the both sides of the big tree. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So how many leaves were under the tree? Very good. It's seven. Okay, are you enjoying our lesson class? Okay, very good. So, based on the activity that we have done, what do you think will be our lesson for today? About mathematics? Yes, very good. About mathematics. In mathematics, our lesson for today is all about addition. Now, what is addition? Any idea what is addition? Addition? Addition is the opposite of subtraction. Yesterday, we talked about subtraction, and subtraction is taking away another amount from another amount. Now, in addition, this is the opposite of subtraction. When we say addition, it is an arithmetic operation refers to taking two or more numbers from other, from other numbers and adding them together. What is addition again? Addition is an arithmetic operation that refers to adding two or more numbers from other numbers and adding them together. Based on the activity that we have done earlier, we do the adding of leaves under the leaves under the three. Three. 
from the left side and from the right side. In left side, there, there were four leaves under the tree. On the right side, there were three leaves under the tree. Now, since addition is all about operation with re which refers to taking two or more numbers and adding them together. So, let's add them together. This is the, this is the number 1, 2, 3, 4. From, from left side, there were four leaves. Four. And while on the other side, there were three leaves. Now, since addition is adding them together, we will add them together. 4 plus 3. 4 added to 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Is equals to? Yes, very good. 7 leaves. There were 7 leaves you pasted under the tree. Now, in addition, there were 2 uh, variables that we are going to uh, simplify. The addends in and the sum. Now, what do you mean by addends? Okay, everybody read. Addends is? A number which is added to another. That is addends. In addition, there are addends and there is a sum. Now, in this situation, can you identify where is the add? Where are the addends here in the situation? Four leaves plus three leaves. Okay, identify it, Jenny. Okay, very good. Jenny identify the equation under the tree that this is the addends. This is the addend. Are you sure that this is the addend? Are you not sure? Okay, let's see. Addend is a number which is added to another. So, Jenny says that this is the addend of an equation. But, in addition, there, they are both whole addends. So, 3 and 4 is addend. So, 3 and 4 is the addend. So, 3 and 4, the 4 leaves on the left side and the 3 leaves on the right side is both added because they are a number which is added together. Kahit balibalik, tarin mo ba yan? 4 plus 3, 4 plus 3 plus 4, added sila pareho. Did you get it, class? What is added? Okay, very good. Clap your hands. Okay, now, another one, in addition, there is what we call the sum. What is sum? Sum will be, no, sum is also a number. Now, let's read the definition of sum. Let's identify. Sum is the total amount from the addition of two or more numbers. Sabi niya, ang sum daw ay yung kabuuang bilang ng dalawang addends. Or dalawa o higit pa na pinagsamang addends. Now, where do you think is the sum of this equation? What do you think is the sum of this equation? 4 plus 3. The 7. Very good. The 7 is the sum of the equation 4 plus 3. Because, kasi pinagsama yung 4 and 3 at ang kinalabasan ay 7. Therefore, ang tawag dito ay sum. Did you get it, class? What is sum again? Yes, very good. Sum is the total amount of two or more addends. So, ito yung sum. So, let's take another example. Or, let's discuss another example. For example, 8 plus 6. So, what, where is the addend in this situation? Dinaligtad ko lang siya kasi pareho lang naman yun sila. Kahit balik-balik ka rin mo siya. Over-over mo lang, pareho lang yun siya. What is the addend? What are the addends in this equation? Yes, Vanessa. 6. Vanessa, you are not listening. Okay? So, the, the addends in this situation is the 8 and 6, Vanessa. Kasi sila yung 2 na pinagsama. Vanessa, ha? You are not listening. Okay. 8 and 6 is the addends. Nakuha mo, Vanessa, ang addends? Okay, very good, Vanessa. Now, what is the sum of the equation 8 plus 6? Okay, bilangin natin, Vanessa. 8 plus 6 plus equals, very good, 14. Now, Vanessa, saan ang sum ng equation ng 8 plus 6? Very good, Vanessa, 14. Kapag pinagsama ang 8 plus 6, ang sagot ay 14. Yun na yung sum. Nakuha niyo ba yung class kung ano ang addends and sum sa addition? 
Very good. Everybody, clap your hands. Did you listen to our lesson proper a while ago? Okay, very good. What is our topic a while ago? Yes, addition. Why do we need to know adding numbers? Because we need to know adding numbers because we can use this in our daily life. Very good. So we will proceed to our group activity. I will divide the class into two groups. Each group will be given a bunch of popsicles. Then I will pronounce an equation and you will show me the sum of the equation using this popsicle. So, magbibigay ako sa inyo ng popsicles. Itong popsicles na ito, gagamitin nyo sa pagkaan. Example, 5 popsicles added by 2. So, 5, then 2. We will count these popsicles into 5 and we will add by 2. So, we will count 1 to 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then, add by 2. One, 6, 7. So, how many popsicles are here? 7 popsicles. So, did you listen? Okay. So, I will distribute now your popsicles. Okay. To, to this group. So, let's start our activity. 5 popsicles plus 5 popsicles equals... Ten popsicles. Very good, group one. Clap your hands. Okay, another example. Three popsicles plus ten popsicles. How many, how do you, what is the sum of the popsicles? Thirteen popsicles. Very good, group two. Clap your hands. So lastly, five popsicles plus three popsicles. How many popsicles is this? Eight popsicles. Very good, group one. So the winner is... The group one. Very good. Kung malaman natin kung nakinig talaga kayo sa ating lesson, we will proceed now to our quiz. So bring out your quiz notebook. After two minutes, we will answer our quiz. Okay? So, count the objects, write the numbers, and find the sum. So, we will count the objects and we will put, we will find out what is the so, we will know first uh, the addicts before we will get the sum, okay? So, number one. We will count. One, how many strawberries are in the left side? So, we will count one, two, go. One, two, three, four, five, six. How many strawberries are here in the left side. So, we will put six. Plus, how many, uh, we will count the strawberries here from the right side. So, one, two, three. How many strawberries are here in the right side? Three. So, we will put three here in the box. So, now, we will solve the all in all strawberries. Six plus three, so we will count all these strawberries. One, two, three, four, five, six, plus seven, eight, nine. So how many strawberries are there? So the sum is nine. Who got the correct answer? Very good. So we will proceed now to Number two. So who got the correct answer? Who got five points here in their quiz? Okay, very good. Let's clap our hands. So, pass your papers. Pass your notebooks. Then, bring out your assignment notebook and copy this. To be passed on next Friday. Okay, very good class. So, let's stand and then pick up a uh, uh, pick up some trash under your uh, chair. Okay. Are you done? Okay. Let us all stand properly. Let's pray. Let's close our eyes, bow down our heads, and follow after me. Dear God, we thank you for this beautiful day. May you guide us in going home for today. This we ask in Jesus' name. We always pray. Amen. Goodbye class.
See you on Monday.